Good day guys, I'm back again for another tutorial. This is HBT tutorial for your basic setup, installation, configuration for some open source application. Okay guys, so for today's tutorial, we will do a basic configuration on how to enable the QC or the quality control. The BG Dial quality control modules allows admin a process to easily review their agent work and verify customer information in advance and the administration select especially for the campaign and statuses of audit okay so you can um so we need to first you need to log into your administrator okay so once again don't forget to like this video or and share if you like it or just also subscribe if you see the subscribe button in your part just click the subscribe button and also the notification bell so that you're always updated on our latest video okay guys so today video we will tackle the quality control so first you need to go to your bg dial administration or administrator so that we can able to or we can able to enable the uh, quality control so as you can see right now you cannot see any quality control on this menu so once we enable we uh, we can able to see the quality control over here so right now i'm using the main administrator the main user so you need to go to your admin okay so after on the admins so once we enable we will see here the quality control okay and then you need to go to your system settings okay so after you go to the system settings you need to scroll down or just control f just type quality okay quality or no you need to check the qc i mean qc okay so this is the qc okay you can set to one to activate okay so up uh, uh you can see here okay claim limit and expired days it means once it's not yet claimed it automatically expired after three days so you can adjust it how many days you want but the recommended is three days so you can change to five or if you are working to seven days just put seven for the seven days and then scroll down then click submit okay so after you click submit you need to go uh, you can check now on your campaign so for example i want to go to here for okay the test campaign and you will see a qc over here okay as you can see you can able to see a QC right here but still you don't have access the QC over there over here okay as you can see so quality control still you can see okay so you need to go to the user groups you can check with the administration okay from here you can all you need to also to allow okay which campaign if you want to allow for QC okay that's okay if you want to uh, allow inbound groups if you want but now we will go to campaign okay so you go to the user again and you need to modify your admin or the QC manager okay so from here you need to enable the following okay this one qc enable one qc level i just put manager uh, okay okay then scroll it down again i just uh, from here i just want to change cyber to put it back to one and then submit so after you enable the qc i uh, can click this one and you can see the quality control over here okay 
and then after that you need to create your if you want uh, you much better to create your scoreboard and this is the QC code if you want to add more QC code like QC like QC decline like deck okay this one is the client then you can add so you have the client then also it's filled okay and then if we can add a quality control scoreboard okay so that means this is the score uh, for the QC just put QCS of the agent if you if you going to uh, and then you can put the points like 20 points okay this is a sample only so you can create your own scoreboard okay okay for now we just put a uh, three scoreboard okay and then after that uh, when you click here as you can see you don't have yet any available QC so and you need to also go to the campaign okay so we can any we our QC was enabled to this campaign and then go here QC select QC statuses check okay so for now yeah, QC template okay scoreboard QC test so we just leave we don't have a script get online to see that's that's going go, no need to check and then submit okay so it means we are ready now uh double check it so go to the let me check here yeah it's only the qc over there and uh, okay so as you can see we have now here a QC statuses okay so once we have a call okay so uh, once we have a call and this po this po is sales or DNC or not interested it will it will go here so if you click here uh, you can you you can see a call over here or the calls or the leads needs to QC uh, once the agents finish so we, we can do some test call let me check uh, agent user again we can use this one for now let's check okay so So we can able to test some calls. Okay. Have an inbound. So for now, if I go to manual dial, and I just dial any number, and if I dial now, okay. Test, 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 and then I hang up then I said this one is ah, from here is solar up so I need to modify it so I just put not interested okay not interested okay so I can enter to postcode no later I just put the 
branch break okay so if I go back over there let me check my quality control so you can see I have one one so test test if I open it okay so this is the this is the QC okay so you can check the lead info score log info callback info so you can see all the leads so also once they have a recording you can able you can also see the recording here and you can start to read or check the recording file okay okay and then for the for the other if you want to add other disposition on the QC so for me uh, because when I check my sales is under solar app oh statuses system statuses let me double check <coughs> So as you can see, my I have made sale over here, but I disabled. And then appointment book is not here. Maybe it's on the campaign. So let me double check the campaign statuses. All right, yeah, it's on the campaign. So I can add this. You, you can add this one just go to the admin so for this one to add additional uh, QC or the display status for QC okay so I just click the QC template so from here I can change this one to solar app DNC and I can submit okay submit successfully and then uh, you can double check okay we can go back to the QC quality control as you can see it's already on solar app so still you have here so you can if you want your, your manager rated here so they can enable and can finish or release the they can change to uh, QC field or pass etc etc okay okay so let me double check something so that i'm trying to make outbound call it's on 999 okay if i call my phone number sorry asara okay using Teronics I'm not sure yeah okay so let's let's make this manual dialed again yeah this this so it's not fast so just hang up okay so if I put solar up can put okay I just put only and then if I check again my QC then you hold up once again okay so as you can see you have new QC call date modify date under solar app okay let me this is one uh what is this QC log info yeah agent dialed off. this one the old one okay so this is the solar app okay yeah this is the solar app ABC auto bc solar app okay you can you can score it and put a comment uh, you can finish or release so if you want here uh, qc pass appointment book 
okay here we go just like that okay so this one is uh dnc dnc one yeah this is a dnc one so you can put zero 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 you see field or so you can put black line you can finish okay so now that's all so hope you are enjoying uh, how to enable the qc on the vg dial so that you can able to uh, do a quality control or qc for all the calls made by the agent especially if uh, appointment book or scheduled appointment or others okay or or anything that you need to qc under your call centers okay guys once again this is hbt tutorial for your basic setup configuration and other open source application thank you again and have a nice day see you for our next video bye bye